when I started when I started the breathwork of you and um in that period it was almost like I was you know starting to get like everything was just like kind of increasing and like my whole energy levels and everything and it was like all this like bliss most of the time and um, of course I also had little dips but then um now it feels more like I'm kind of in this healing stage of like constantly crying and purging and like like just releasing 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 a lot and um yeah and and um what else like definitely um I'm definitely like I was reflecting this morning on like comparing to like three months ago like I'm constantly like checking my breath the way I'm breathing like just throughout the day and um even though sometimes you know I don't do like a, a full breathwork session I'm still always kind of like checking in with myself so I was like yeah okay. <laughs> at least I got that and then yeah, the, the mental yeah. breath work that we talked about yeah exactly like that's kind of something that I don't really need to remind myself um for anymore and um and I definitely feel like I, I have become a lot more aware of of um yeah of myself and like of, of other situations and like and and like my body and um and if I think of it like I have already like the whole uh like my sense of like appetite for food is definitely like decreased a lot like I, I just think I'm probably just too like I'm, I I know like I'm just too harsh on myself like I wanted I wanted to like yeah I'm gonna change like this you know and then if I don't change as fast as I want it to happen, then, um, yeah, you know, I think that, oh, I don't have enough discipline or whatever. But then if I actually look back, I'm like, oh, yeah, it's, it's yeah, I'm still, like, improving. Or, like, improving in, in the sense of, like, I do feel like I am um, becoming, like, more and more, like, myself in a way. Like, Yeah. That, that's um like um what you were you were i like how you said that because you know many people who are into the fasting world and and you know have problems with cravings and binge eating they some of them do do breath work but none of them real the people at least who come to me because they don't really dive too much in the parasympathetic which is what we did for the last three months and i'm happy you're finally seeing the benefits of that rather than stimulation holding the breath and all these different things because because that's what in, in hindsight people can't realize that you're you're actually addicted to um certain breath patterns it, it it's so subtle <laughs> but that's what you're really addicted to even even though we may look at we may look at um tv and all this type of stuff as oh that's simulation too but you don't realize that you're actually addicted to the the external world affecting your internal world rather than giving more power to your internal world rather than letting the external world affect you and that's why people say hey i've, I've tried breath work on fasting and it's not really helping blah 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 well have mm. you really tapped deep into the parasympathetic rather than stimulating simulation after simulation after simulation and mm. that's what we did the, the, <laughs> the last three months and you can see for yourself how different it really is right yeah 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 it's really it's like this uh, it's very subtle and I guess you know I feel, uh, probably like the longer of course like you know I just keep on going like I'll more and more like see the effects but it's yeah because we're also used to like we want this like you know if it's not the magic pill or that then it's like it's gratification. breath work it's the magic breathwork technique that will, you know, just like poof all your problems. Like that doesn't work. <laughs> exactly. It, it, it's it's a yeah. process. That's that that's the point of alchemy. It's it's a system. It's not a it's not a technique. It's how am I implementing these little things, utilizing Einstein's mm-hmm. compound effect into my everyday life rather than just a sit down session. Because you know when you when you're going back and forth to uni. You see how you're utilizing the breathing technique, so the stresses of the of uh, uni isn't too much hard on you. 
Yeah, and, yeah. And, and yeah, you can feel and, the difference. <laughs> and what you also said with like how we're so used to like, um, you know, or like we think the external world um, affects the internal and like that opposition. And, you know, how I was talking to you about um, my like struggle with university because it's like so um, feels like so like not in alignment with me, like the whole system. Right. And I, I w- I've been going through like, you know, like a lot of like contemplation. Okay, like, hey, what should I do? Da, da, da. And like really only in the last couple of days um, or like probably a week ago or something, I really, I was like, okay, like this doesn't make sense. Like for me to put so much um, energy into this because I would go to uni and then I would be driving home crying because I was like, I don't want to do this. You know, like <laughs> this can't be like, um like the the way I'm 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 putting my energy at like deciding to like lose my energy and uh in like to this situation institution or whatever it is um doesn't make sense because at the end of the day like no in a way like no matter where I am like I should be able to you know like stay peaceful within myself like it doesn't you know, and then, and it was this, like, whole process that I was, like, I understand that intellectually, it's not actually the university that's making me feel like this, and then, um, yeah, I had, like, a long conversation with my mother, and, like, all sorts of things kind of, like, happened, and, um, and yesterday, I was at university, and, um, and I, we had to do this assignment, and I just like sat down and just like, and I was like in an instant flow. And I was, yesterday I did only, um, only urine and I had some dandy tea. So like, and I, so I was fasting all day long and I just like six hours, I was just sitting there and like smashing this assignment out. And I was like, where's this even coming from? Like, it was so weird. And it was like, because, because I knew, because I could see how like, I was at the institution, like, my, all my energy was, like, this is bad, like, uh, what you're teaching us is bullshit, da, da, da. so I had all this resistance, so I was, like, in a way, making it harder for myself, and, but I still didn't feel this, like, big yes that I should stop it, because I still see the, um, the value of, of what I'll be getting, you know, when I actually have uh, the osteopathy certification what I can actually do with that like it will open me a lot of doors and then when I you know when I have that allowance in a way to work on that level like that's when I can incorporate you know breath work and I can incorporate fasting exactly. with patients you know whereas now I know at this stage like you, you 